Hey everyone, Joel Anson here. Today, we are back in Toronto at Monkey Thai Sushi. Now, the new location of Monkey Sushi, this is their eighth location. We're back with the owner, Mr. Da. Da is having us out um, to try a new challenge. I did a sushi challenge at Monkey Sushi previously, but now Monkey Sushi offers Thai food as well. So, Da, we got sushi and Thai food, is that right? Yes, exactly. So, welcome to Monkey Thai and Sushi. My old friends, and let's Let's start it. Yeah, I will say it was absolutely delicious last time, but again, last time was only a sushi challenge. Yes. But this time we're gonna actually, you're, you want to do a challenge with the Thai food. So I know we're gonna have like pad thai, we're having uh, some different curries, um, you know, a lot of good sounding dishes. This is actually one of my, I think this will be my first time doing a Thai dish, or like a Thai video. Yes. So I'm super excited to try it out. I'm sure it's delicious. I know the sushi is delicious here, but yeah, I look really forward to this. So uh, let's go on in. I'll give them the exact details here in a moment. And uh, yeah, like I said, thanks for having us out, Mr. Da. It's good to see uh, old friends. Love working with restaurants, and uh, here we are again. So how do we say we get eating? Okay, sure. Let's go. Everyone's here with all the food. It looks very, very delicious. So we have the traditional signature pad thai. We have their ginger beef. I have their sweet crispy beef, which is a signature here, which sounds very, very delicious. We then have their lovely looking spicy basil chicken. These all look so and smell so good, let's be honest. Then of course, you can't come here without trying their sushi. I've had the sushi before, I know it's very, very good. We're here to do it again. So we have, for example, um, some of their salmon nigiri. I have a uh, signature torched black dragon roll, spicy salmon roll. I have a lovely um, soft shell crab roll. Then I have some more of the uh, tuna. We have some butterfish nigiri here. I have a lovely set of their sashimi. Then I also have some spicy tuna and spicy uh, salmon rolls up here. So a nice variety of sushi. And then of course all these Thai dishes with more Thai dishes. We then have their, um, this is a coconut chicken, which I'm very, very excited to try. And then I also have their green curry, their green curry here, which also looks and smells delicious. Made with coconut milk, looks fantastic. And um, we do have some rice on the side as well, um, which is what the uh, uh, these Thai dishes are served with. Um, but yeah, pretty much that's about it. So we're gonna get started. I'm super excited. I haven't had Thai food in a very, very long time. Never done a Thai food video, so this is my first time. And uh, how do you with sushi? So with that, let's get started here and uh, should be fun. So we're gonna have 30 minutes to complete this here. It's definitely not a lot of time. There's definitely a lot of food, but it all looks and smells very delicious. Probably gonna start with one of these dishes here. Maybe I'll start with this lovely, lovely looking spicy smelling basil chicken. So we get started, let's hit the count five, four, uh, I don't have my phone, but three, two, one, let's go. Mm. Ooh. That is sweet. A little heat to it. Mm. Oh yeah. Mm. That basil. That is beautiful. Some napkins as well. Hey everyone, welcome to this video. Today we're here at Monkey Sushi and Thai. Yes, so pretty cool that they integrated the Thai in there and bringing us our first Thai food video. So here we had a wide variety of dishes in front of us, not only again having some sushi, but we had everything from like basil chicken to some uh, different curries, like a coconut green curry. Um, we had their signature spicy beef, some pad thai, really a whole bunch of different items. Yeah, got flavor on that? Absolutely delicious. Great heat to it. Mm. I'm uh, let's try this. Go over this one here. The beef, ginger beef. Mm. Lovely ginger flavor on that. So this was definitely a very large challenge and with 30 minutes I knew I kind of had to like focus because there was a lot of food in front of me. Each of those uh, Thai dishes were very very good in size, they had a very nice portion especially like when it came to like the pad thai and everything just very very large. Um, we then had 
you know, like the curries, which were a good size, plus all the sushi. So this was definitely at least eight pounds of food, but I think this is probably scraping a little bit more to that like nine, maybe at least nine. Really, I if, yeah, if I had to bet at least nine pounds of food, might even have been a little bit more, but we'll definitely go with nine. Um, very large challenge, but very delicious. And this is kind of the foods I really like. I really like like meats and vegetables. Um, I love like, like soups and curries, like the coconut coconut curries and stuff, so I was really in for a treat. So come on, let's say two and a half minutes in. I love it. The meats are tender. Vegetables are perfectly cooked. And it just feels, it feels so healthy. You're so delicious. That was beautiful. And the chicken I had before that was absolutely amazing as well. All right, so I know I have some rice dishes here. So I'll try this next one, some rice. It looks like a very rice sitting. Mix in my mouth. Woo! Just mm. like there's some of that pineapple. Mm. Oh yeah. Mm. Very sweet. Can I get those really lovely flavors that I like patchy sauce? Little aspects of like fish sauce. So as I mentioned, this was the first time that I had Thai food in a very long time. So comment down below and let me know what your favorite Thai food dish is. And well, I mean, if you haven't had it, then I think you should definitely try it at some point soon. Um, with this challenge, so the overall value was about 100 bucks. Again, we were gonna get the meal for free if we we're able to complete it. So it's definitely what we were hoping for. Uh, I knew that the Thai dishes I found, at least like the ones I had so far at this point, were not really spicy. Um, one of the ones, I believe it was maybe the crispy beef or one of the one of the chickens I had was kind of like it had a little bit of a heat emblem noted with it, but I didn't find it like overly hot or overly spicy, so it was very, very palatable, again, very flavorful. Plus, I mean, a little bit of heat. I like a little bit of heat myself. Gotta spice things up, you know, the spice of life, I guess you could say. Um, that being said, I'm sure some of the dishes are quite a bit spicier and you could definitely ask for them to be spicier. I just kind of went with the, you know, the standard versions as they, uh, as the items came on the menu. I'm gonna try this uh, green curry. I think this green curry sounds really good. Looks really good. Playing my camera here. Make a little small adjustment. There you go. All right, let's try this curry out. Got some chicken here as well. Ooh, oh man. Mm. Oh damn, that's delicious. Mm, coconut. Mm, a little spicy. But it's so rich and creamy. This is just, that's just crazy. Mm. Ooh, they said surprisingly spicy though. But that is, uh, that is, that is amazing. Spicy, but so creamy. Mm. So rich. I like that a lot actually. Got some coconut, uh, coconut chicken here. Really nice flavor that as well. 
But that, everybody, that's pretty much all the info I have for you today. Pretty straightforward. So let's get to the rest of the video. Hopefully we can complete this challenge. Definitely not a lot of time for such a big, big challenge. But I'll talk some more about the food. And with that, let's ultimately see what happens. Let's drive this pad thai. So it's been a long time since I had pad thai. But this is their famous pad thai. This is the signature. We got the shrimp and the chicken. After signature combination. Oh wow. Okay, okay. I did. Damn, this is a big, huge portion too. That is giant. Oh. Oh man, that flavor. I really like pad thai's. It's something I don't get how often. But this is definitely worth a try. Very, very delicious. The, uh, just like the flavors in there. There's a lot of ingredients to go into pad thai. And just the sweetness, the crispness, very enjoyable. All right, now back to some of their delicious sushi. Like I said, last time, very delicious. I'm sure this would be no different, although we were at a different location. Again, this is actually their eighth, eighth location, which is pretty crazy to think about. So eighth location, definitely taking over Toronto. Whew, a lot of food. Those pad thai dishes are, or the, the thai dishes are very heavy, very filling. Excuse me. All right. Mm, probably start with this, uh, maybe the torch dragon roll. Barbecue eel on top. Rich, savory. The flavor of eel and avocado together is just fantastic. I remember last time saying they have really good salmon, and that still stands. That was very delicious. Just so like silky, soft, succulent. There's more spicy salmon rolls and some spicy tuna rolls here. I'll dive into these. I'll do the sashimi last. Huge portion of salmon in that.
Oh, that tuna is very, very good as well. Now then the sashimi, we have some crab, I have some shrimp, I have some snapper, and some salmon. I like a little wasabi with that. Shoot up. Same thing. Beautiful portion. Beautiful. All right, we are finished. The Thai dishes were absolutely phenomenal. I knew the sushi was already gonna be great, and it definitely was. Definitely lived up to the expectation. But I will say, those Thai dishes, I think that green curry was probably my favorite. Um, the actual pad thai itself was very, very, very delicious. Um, like I said, it's been a long time since I had any Thai food. I have had like a pad thai before, but this one I think was definitely a lot more dynamic, and I love the flavor of it. It, it tasted just very like fresh, and it tasted very, savory and it was rich and, and I had the different textures you know from I believe which was egg and then you had the chicken I really like that all this is very 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 delicious and like I said I absolutely loved to love that green curry like coconut milk base just very very delicious exception but that um, so that's about that I know Don picked 30 minutes because he figured it'd be give me a bit of a difficulty we definitely used up the vast majority of that time so this was definitely a, a good size challenge. Um, huge thanks to Monkey Sushi, huge thanks to Doug for having us out. This is, like I said, um, a really cool spot. They have not only multiple locations serving sushi around Toronto, but now this location serving sushi and Thai food. Um, this one is on Queen Street. Um, but that, that's pretty much about it. Uh, you know, I, I might honestly even get another one of those curries. It was that freaking good, seriously. It was that good. That good. Um, but that's pretty much for today, buddy. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. I definitely enjoyed eating it. Hopefully you enjoyed it at least half as much as I did. Um, but yeah, it was very delicious. Huge thanks to everybody here. Um, so I think you can go for free, which is awesome. And uh, if not, I don't know if I mentioned this earlier, but the value would have been like just over $100, something around there. So uh, yeah, but very delicious. I very much enjoyed it. So I want to course the next time. So happy, really hungry, happy eating. And uh, that's about it, you know? Have a lovely day, have a lovely life. I don't think I even got soy sauce on my shirt. I'm gonna double check that here in a moment. And uh, that's about it. So again, thank you everybody. Hope you enjoyed. And uh, yeah, if you're in the area, monkey sushi. And with Thai, monkey Thai sushi. Till next time everybody. And I was wrong. Look at this. Where are we, right here. I don't know if you can see, we got the, those little stains. My green shirt did not make it out with the getting brown soy sauce on it. Close, but not quite. Hi everyone, thank you so much for watching today's video. I really appreciate it. If you click my face right here, you can subscribe. Yes, that's right, click my face, subscribe guys. It helps me out, it helps you out, then you don't miss an upload, and hopefully I can meet you when I come to your city. Also, click a video right here. I specifically picked two videos, yes, that's right, two videos specifically for you right here. So click a video right now, get that going, and it's gonna end, so click one quick. Let's go, let's go, and have a great day.